So Spen, just finishing off your second session and obviously we're working on this first move away to try and get you on a better, better plane. Yeah. So we've talked about how the butt end of the golf club should point more uh, at your torso this way which will keep the, the, the club more out in front of plane yeah. um, or keep the head more in front of you yeah so we've got butt end of the golf club pointing at the torso yeah. head more in front rather than the head being under plane here yeah. um, but then we've just put a different twist on that today we've just talked about that slightly differently which which seems to have helped uh, we've talked about the sweet spot yeah. and pointing the sweet spot uh, the, the face to the ball so we've talked about keeping the face pointing down to the ball rather than fanning the face I'm okay. open or an old traditional square yeah. yeah have I explained that okay so yeah. um, this this image on the left he just pivots his body and keeps the face pointing down to the ball there's no opening or rotating of the of the face and then that does everything that we want it keeps the butt end pointing at your torso keeps the head more out in front of you yeah, and keeps the more and keeps the club more on plane so you'll see here you've got a lot of rotation of the hands and a lot of opening of the face and then that does everything else that you don't want so you were talking about connection here you were talking about butt end here but but all that's linked yeah have i explained that okay mate yeah, yeah. so face to ball that's your only task in the move away um there's loads of different swings out there but one thing that we see that they have in common is they move the club on that plane face down to ball sweet spot plane This is with a metal face to ball. Some old footage of McElroy, this is with a wedge face to ball. Yeah. A little bit harder to see with a wedge because there's more loft. Yeah, that makes sense. You know, if that was a hockey stick, that'd be with zero loft or a putter, that'd be a little bit easier to to yeah. see but um, because you've got 56 degrees of loft there yeah. it's a little bit easier to, to see but look how that keeps butt end to tar uh, butt end to the, the torso yeah. club will be out in front of your club moving on plane and that will really help your sequencing of your, of your swing so that it, we can steepen it up a little bit in this part no, happy yeah brilliant yeah, really good cheers mate. thanks Richard cheers, mate. cheers.